don't forget, today's the day you <laughs> promised to clean out the attic. Country classics, Treasures from the Attic, has returned to the Fallsview Theatre this week. The show is a journey through the golden years of country music, told from the perspective of a man sent to clean out his attic. It features over 40 of the greatest country songs of all time, sung live by some of Nashville's best talent. Anybody, whether you're a music fan or not, uh, the story that is, is written and produced and with Hardy telling it from the attic, you just can't deny, I think, for, for an audience listener to, to just be uh, engulfed in the story and the, the way it's told through spoken word and music. Nashville native Eric Heatherly is enjoying his first time performing country classics, even if it is during the middle of a Canadian winter. It's been fantastic. Uh, number one, being in Canada is great. The weather's been nice and crisp and fresh. And uh, coming from the south, uh, it's just a change of scenery for me, and it's a good group of friends, great musicians, so I've really enjoyed it. What do you like about the songs that you've been uh, chosen to sing? Uh, I'm a music historian. I study it, I record it, write it, produce it back home. Uh, I have a huge vinyl collection. So when uh, Rob Asselstein uh, called me and said, would you do this? Uh, it took me about 10 seconds to say yeah. All these songs pretty much in the show, I grew up listening to my dad spin on vinyl records when I was growing up. So when I'm singing them, I'm picturing like going down the road in that 65 Chevy pickup or whatever, you know, uh, AM radio stations. And those scenarios play through my, my mind when I'm performing them. I hear you singing in the Megan Shanley, a former Miss America contestant, is also enjoying her time singing at Fallsview. So my story of getting into music is, is a lot different than most people. I didn't start singing until I was 17. And um, my dad was a huge country music fan, and so it was always on in the car. Um, and Patsy Cline just was always one of my favorites, and I kind of learned how to sing along with her. So I think a lot of my um, inflections in country music is, uh, I share a lot with Patsy, because she was a huge role model. Did you have an attic growing up in Virginia? Gosh, I did, and I, I think that's where my fear of spiders came from. <laughs> that's why I put everything in the basement. Holy moly, yeah, we had an attic when we didn't go in there, but, uh, but now, nowadays I have a storage unit, so that's my attic. So you'll find, I'm, I'm such a sentimental person that I can't throw things away that, that mean things to me. You'll find all kinds of stuff from my time at Miss America, and then all the shows I've done up here with Rob, and I keep, you know, I keep, a lot of things from it, t-shirts and signs and posters. So. Michael Lanning has performed country classics since 2007 and he's excited that it's back after a six-year hiatus. I think the one that I get to do that's my favorite is He Stopped Loving Her Today by George Jones. Uh, it's just a, it's, it's really sad but it's so poignant. Now Hardy is up in the attic telling the story, the narrative. What's it like working with him? He's awesome. I mean, he's, he's, a, he's a great uh, storyteller, he's a great actor, uh, and he's just a lot of fun, off stage as well. That's one of the things about, that makes the show so great, is that we have such an incredible camaraderie in the cast and the, and the musicians and all. It's just so, you know, everybody gets along so well, it's like family. Rounding out the Country Classics family is BC native Andrea Pearson. Nashville is home for her now, but Niagara Falls and Fallsview will always hold a special place in her heart. I'm not kidding about this. I tell everybody how much I love this stage and the sound and the whole theater and the people. I love it. Still, to me, it's like country music is all about a story and a lyric. That's one of the things I love so much about the show. And it takes you through this whole journey of country music. I'm sure that people that didn't even listen to country music much will know these songs because they're classic. You know, you've probably heard your dad sing them or grandpa or whatever, but uh, it really takes you through this whole music history and it's, it's awesome. It's a fun show. Country Classics Treasures from the Attic runs until Saturday, February the 11th here at the Fallsview Theatre. To purchase tickets, go online to Ticketmaster.ca or call the Fallsview box office. In Niagara Falls reporting for The Source, I'm Mark Wickabredo.